Welcome back. Houston County teachers kicked off the school year this morning at a back to school convocation for teachers and staff. More than 2,500 teachers and staff gathered at Southside Baptist Church. They presented awards to teachers and support persons of the year. The theme of the event leading the way as school leaders praised the hard work of their staff across their 37 schools. Now, towards the end of today's ceremony, Superintendent Mark Scott made a special announcement. He announced he'll retire in spring of 2025. Camila Williams shares what his deputy superintendent had to say about his departure. It is with a mix of emotions that I announced my retirement as superintendent of schools. 40 years in education. At the end of this school year. We're just proud of him. House and County School Superintendent Richard Rogers says hearing Superintendent Mark Scott's news is sad, but working together was exceptional. He has really given, you know, public education his life. And he, he says there's two types of, uh, of uh, employees, those who teach and those who support teachers. Rogers says their strengths and weaknesses complement each other and their teamwork and always working to do what's best for the staff and students is known as the House and County way. He has really modeled effective leadership with our team, and we're all better because of him. Scott says he decided to retire after his wife retired last year. He says he's overwhelmed with joy, but considers everyone in the district family. The people you work with, you care about them, and uh, it, it's a difficult thing, but uh, I'll still be in the community. I'll still be supporting the school district just from a different role. While his retirement plans are clear, he's looking forward to what's ahead. Our students will continue to do great things. Our, our teachers and leaders across our district will, will continue to be leaders across our state. From opening new schools, making sure the students had Chromebooks and renovating current ones, Rogers says Scott's accomplishments won't go unnoticed. So working with Dr. Scott is just keeping people in the forefront, making the best decisions for this district, and just not leaving any part of the district out. But Scott's four decades of supporting teachers and staff will always be the way for the school district. In Houston County, Camila Williams, 13 WMAZ News. Now in 2014, Scott took over from Robin Hines, a fellow former Northside principal. Hines now works with the Georgia High School Association.